Hello and welcome to Recipe Lounge. Thank you so much for joining me. And today I am making pasta with sauce. I'm going to make the sauce here. And I hope this is going to be a very different type of sauce. So I hope you will enjoy watching and then maybe later making. So here I have, um, I'm going to add two cups of pasta. I've already put one uh, cup in. So I'm going to go ahead and add another one. You can get, this is the second cup, you can get pasta, you know, different shapes and um, yeah. So I've got two cups of uh, pasta in there and the water is boiling and I'm going to go ahead and add uh, a teaspoon of salt in there and um, I'm going to boil this for about 10 minutes. So let's have a look what we need for the sauce. So here I have uh, coriander, fresh coriander and here I have um, spring onions, half a cup, two green chilies and some walnuts, almonds and pine nuts. You will also be using some fresh cream, double cream. Put pine nuts and uh, pine nuts and the uh, almonds and walnuts in there. I'm going to go ahead and add the chilies and the coriander and the spring onion. So I'm going to go ahead and add two tablespoons of double cream. And now we're going to go ahead and blend. So we're going to blend everything together. This is um, very thick, so I'm going to go ahead and add some water, about two to three tablespoons from the pasta, boiling pasta. And this will help it um, blend better, but also it'll be giving a bit of taste of the uh, pasta flavouring. So I've added about three tablespoons of water from the pasta. Now I'm going to go ahead and blend again. And this is the consistency we wanted. I'm going to go ahead and add um, um, half a teaspoon of salt. And then mix really well. Go ahead, the pasta is cooked, I'm going to have to I'm going to go ahead and add two tablespoons of uh, butter and let this butter melt away. Now I'm going to go ahead and add the sauce that we made and mix it really well. Now this uh, sauce you can store as well and uh, use it for other dishes like meat or as a spread on the sandwich. It is really tasty. You can add mint to this as well. Really mouth watering, delicious recipe of this sauce. So I'll put them in the serving dish and I'm going to sprinkle some nuts. It's nice to have a little low crunch. So, yes, I hope you uh, enjoyed watching this recipe and you will try this at least once. So thank you so much for watching, until next time, bye everyone!